Are you looking to break into analytics, but you're not quite sure how to get your foot in the door? Well, in this video, I'm going to break down three different paths of how you can learn analytics skills. Hey, it's Sean David here with How to Get an Analytics Job. Before I start this video, please like this content if you find it useful. Also, subscribe and ring the bell if you want notifications about upcoming posts. So in this video, we're going to talk about three different paths to learning analytics skills. The three paths are university or your classical education, boot camps, and self-taught. And I kind of see them existing in a spectrum. So on the far right of the spectrum is your classical education. And on the far left is your 100% self-taught. So your classical education is by far the most expensive. But with that expense comes a lot of advantages. So you have benefits like networks. You also have that college experience. So when you're learning on your own, you're just kind of maybe in your basement or in your attic or you know maybe just in your spare bedroom. So you don't get that community feel like you would at a university. But there's no guarantee though if you get a university degree in analytics of a job at the end of it. In fact, I am the poster boy for squandering a university degree. My undergraduate degree is in economics and when I graduated, I had zero skill set. And that it was actually my fault because I took zero internships. I didn't really apply myself to the learning. Um, I, I just kind of was lazy and just partied a lot. And that's totally on me. So if you get a university degree, make sure that you are actively engaged. In fact, when I was you know coming out of high school, I was too immature to go to undergrad and I should have probably waited for a few years. Now, that being said, of my poor undergraduate degree, when I went back for my master's, I killed it. So I took on three internships. I learned Tableau, which is a data visualization software. So by the time that I graduated with my MBA, I was able to launch my own consulting agency. So that's kind of the things that you need to consider when you're thinking about a university degree. The next is a boot camp. So in the middle is kind of that happy medium of boot camps don't cost as much as university degrees, but you know, you're not getting that full four or two year experience. So boot camps are a great way to transition, especially if you're already working in a field that you want to pivot into an analytics role in. For example, if you're working as a marketing specialist, you could take a boot camp and very quickly pivot from a marketing specialist into a marketing analyst role. And then finally, self-taught. This is an awesome path, especially if you don't have a lot of money but you have a lot of time. The only downside is, is that it's hard to know what's good content and what's not good content. YouTube, Reddit, community forums like Power BI or Tableau's forums are great resources for you to get free educational material. So if you are on Tableau's forums, you can just type in the question that you have and a lot of times community members will answer them. The only downside of this is it's not really curated. So if someone is answering your question, they may have downloaded Tableau for the first time last week. So there are, little, there are little risk involved in terms of being self-taught. So that pretty much sums up my thoughts on the difference between university degree, a boot camp, and being self-taught. Thanks for tuning in and I'll see you next time.